guys, so recently we have been really into Doodle World. And inside of Doodle World, you actually have a concept art suggestion channel. And I wanted to do a video where I showcased all the different doodles and skins that people made. But honestly, there are so, so many good ideas that I decided to split the video up into skins and doodles. This video will be looking at 10 skins that I think are absolutely amazing and need to get in the game. Are you ready? Let's look to the first skin. So the first skin or skins is actually made by someone. Dot. And he made a whole collection of skins. He didn't give a name of how they would be called. But they kind of look like the simple skin. And if they aren't worthy of being a simple skin, I would just call them minimalist. I actually really, really like these. And honestly, these might be the skin that I would be rocking if these get in the game. I think they're really simple, but really effective. And I would totally, totally love to see these when I hunt in the wild. Coming up next is actually from somebody that I can't pronounce the name unfortunately but it is this guy and he made a really cool Easter skin for Sheldo. Now the Easter event is almost around the corner and maybe by the time that you see this video has even already been released. So I have no idea if this even got in the game and if I'm just reviewing something that literally is in the game right now. But this looks absolutely amazing and I would love to see this. Unfortunately, we can't really hunt for it. So if it were to get in this Easter event, maybe they will make Sheldo available for a little bit. But either way, it looks really, really cool. And I would definitely love to hunt this whenever Sheldo becomes available. Coming up at number three, we have Brett with school thingy a, a basic school uniform for the Morville line i absolutely love the Morville line i still have to say Morville default skin is still my absolute favorite but for some reason this skin fits really really well it looks definitely like these doodles were made for the skin and i would definitely definitely hunt for them it also helps a ton that the art style of bread that she shows is exactly like how the game is so honestly you could just copy paste these place them in the game and they would wouldn't look out of place they would be absolutely amazing and i would totally totally hunt for this skin number four from peaker zia pumpkin kekmeow for halloween 2022 so I actually really, really like this. I, I'm a sucker for Halloween and scary skins. So for one, that already gives it a really, really great edge. While I'm not a fan of Kek Meow in general, I actually think that this skin totally fixes that for me. And I would totally have this on my team. I really like how the tail has a face on it. It really reminds me of Girafferic, which I think is absolutely, absolutely cool. I think maybe the flower could have been something different, like maybe a more scarier flower. But other than that, I think this is absolutely amazing. Really nice job. Coming up next, which is probably everybody's favorite doodle for whatever reason. It is Louise. Sketch Louise. Now, honestly, and I'm not gonna make myself very popular with this, I don't really care for Louise. I think he is way too overrated for what he is. I don't like him. But you know what? This skin, I actually quite like. And honestly, I would say, let's just not do a sketch skin for Louise, but let's do a sketch skin for every single doodle in this game. Because this looks Awesome. I have no idea what the misprint would be. Maybe like have like a little pencil color it in or something. I'm not quite sure, but it looks absolutely phenomenal. I would totally hunt this and it looks cool. There isn't anything more to say about it. It just looks cool. And if you thought that was cool, take a look at this really cool lantern lil bulb. 
I adore this and it gives me such great vibes for an event skin. This would definitely be an event skin during Lunar New Year, some, somewhere around that time or just during regular New Year. I definitely love this. I think Little Bulb is already one of the best designed doodles in the entire game and this just fits. It makes sense. It, it works really really well and honestly honestly we need to talk i would definitely hunt the misprint version because that blue color is absolutely amazing i love it for the next one i thought i would pick something a little bit more scary we all got those really cute and cool doodles but why not some more scary ones and this one is so unique i have like nobody has done this before and it is spooky glubby like it completely changed the entire concept of glubby and honestly i think that's okay i think more skins can go this risky changing the entire design route i think it looks really really cool and really makes the skin unique if it ever got in the game i think having this just makes i mean it makes glubby more interesting as a character and i think we should do this more for other doodles where it's it's still you know it's still a character in some way but it's like it's coming out of a completely different universe if you know what i mean i think just the concept behind it is more than enough to make this a 10 out of 10 skin we're almost coming up to the last few but don't worry we still got this really really epic skin for our mr needling now unfortunately i couldn't find if this guy actually did prickles maybe he did by now but cookie master you nailed it you kept the really easy and nice design of needling and just completely changed this concept around instead of happy cactus you got sad cactus and i think it works i think it really really works and out of all the skins that needling has and I'm not even sure if he any has any skins. I would definitely pick this one. I think it looks really cool. It tells a story. He got bitten and now he's sad. I mean, what more do you want? It's the best story ever. And I would totally buy this book. Now this next one is actually of a character that I know that almost nobody likes. It is a skin for party book. And it's called Magical Party Book. Now, okay, okay. I know... We don't like party bug or whatever. I have no idea why. I think he looks cool. But I've seen a lot of people dislike party bug. But come on. You gotta admit. This skin is pretty cute. This unicorn skin. I really like it. I, I think it actually makes him a lot more bearable. And I think if this was his actual design. A lot more people would like him. So why not make it a skin. And you can hunt for it. And get your own super cool party bug. I'm all in for it. And last but not least for our boy Vip Ember and his evolutions. When I saw this, I just needed to include this. This needs to be in the game. And honestly, this would be a skin that I would fight for to get in the game. With promotions and everything. Because this is amazing. I love this. This would definitely be the best skin vibe ember would ever get like hands down this is such a funny concept it works because it, it, it like you can still recognize him as vip ember even though his design completely changed and i think that's such a unique and cool thing i really think tired artist 75 did a great job of capturing the essence of vibe ember but still making it completely unique and amazing to look at this would definitely be the skin that i would be spending all my life savings on to get on the roulette so those were the 10 skins that i think need to get in the game and hopefully at least one of them dudes wish if you're watching this, come on dude, give me one, give me two, give me three, or even better, add all of them. But <laughs> let's be honest, that's probably a lot of work that isn't going to happen. So if we only get one of these in the game, that would be A-OK. -okay. 
Which one of these skins was your favorite? And are you excited to look at all the cool doodles that people made? Be sure to hit that like and subscribe button. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye bye.